right, verse 5, but the rest of the dead live not again until the thousand years are finished. This is the first resurrection. Alright, so two things of note here. The rest of the, of the dead live not again until the thousand years were finished. So I want to point to Daniel chapter 12. If I can find it here. Verse 2, and many of them that slept I'm sorry, many of them that sleep in the dust of the earth shall awake, some to everlasting life, and some to shame and everlasting contempt. So this is not a new concept. This has uh, been taught all throughout the Bible. And that is at the end of the world, there is the resurrection. All right, some to everlasting life, and some to shame and everlasting contempt. Now let's go back here at when the thousand years are finished this is the end of the world all right so this is described as uh, this right here the rest of the dead live not again until the thousand years are finished this is the first resurrection this first resurrection quote unquote happens before the end of the thousand years all right, read it again. But the rest of the dead live not again until the thousand years were finished. This is the first resurrection. First resurrection before the end of the thousand years. So let's go and see if we can figure out who is the first resurrection. 1 Corinthians 15, verse 20. But now is Christ risen from the dead and become the first fruits of them that slept. Jesus is the first fruits of them that slept. So he is the resurrection. He is the first resurrection. And we are partakers of his resurrection, which happens um, at the end of the thousand years when we will be resurrected. In other words, we will be lifted up in the air to be with the Lord. And so shall we ever be with the Lord. Right? First Thessalonians 4 For the Lord himself shall descend from heaven with a shout, with the voice of the archangel, and with the trump of God, and the dead in Christ shall rise first. Then we which are alive and remain shall be caught up together with them in the clouds to meet the Lord in the air. And so shall we ever be with the Lord. This is at the end of the thousand years. And right now we are partakers of his resurrection.